filmmakers in New Jersey and other cash-strapped states here in the U.S. are facing a real situation. Shows including the Jersey Shore are being forced to say goodbye to their tax breaks. Megan Hughes in Washington with more on this tax trend. Megan? Hi there, Scarlett. A fun story here. Some say Chris Christie was playing critic in chief. He wasn't certainly getting any fist bumps from the MTV show's fans or creators when last month he vetoed a $420,000 tax credit that would have supported the reality show. Some called it a yes, Snooky subsidy. It was supposed to be part of the first round of credit since Christie suspended the film tax credit program in the state in 2010 to close the budget gap. Now, it's not just taking away tax dollars, paying for fake tans in Jersey, though, Scarlett. Squashing film subsidies has really become a trend around the country. Our tax team at Bloomberg Government found Washington State, Idaho, Arizona, Arkansas, Maine, all of those states let their programs expire. Michigan, once at 42 percent, the most aggressive tax break in the country, is now capped at $25 million. And New Jersey, as I mentioned, Kansas and Iowa all suspended their programs. Iowa, interestingly, of course, famously depicted in the 1989 classic Field of Dreams, had its own drama, a scandal actually, actually shut down that program. $32 million in credits went to 22 film companies. And Scarlett, out of that, a state auditor found $25 million was improperly issued. Now, there are a few states still expanding programs, Alabama, Illinois, Maryland, to name a few. And the film industry is fighting these cuts, arguing it's a bad move for the economy. Nobody wins. There, it, it, what you're doing is you're taking jobs away from people and tax revenue for the state. So there doesn't seem it is a lose-lose proposition to, to cut these tax programs. The Center on Budget and Policy Priorities here in Washington, though, found some conflicting results that the incentives don't actually help create permanent, high-paying jobs, often go towards projects that may have gr been green-lighted without the state help, so don't really provide much state stimulus. Scarlett. So Megan